Hey guys, up here for TFP TV. We are at SHOT Show 2023 Industry Range Day. It is extre extremely windy. I'm gonna start that over, I can't even talk. Hey guys, up here for TFP TV at SHOT Show 2023 Industry Range Day in a gale force wind. Talking to Shauna with Silencer Co. about their new flow-through suppressor. Yeah, so we just launched this suppressor today. It's our Velos LBP. So it's our first low back pressure suppressor. So we let more of the gas go through the front of the suppressor. You're gonna get less gas blow back to the face, um, but without sacrificing sound suppression. So it's also our most durable suppressor. It's 556 dedicated. So you can shoot it on full auto. You can shoot it on short barreled rifles. There's no barrel restrictions. Um, and it's made out of really durable materials. So you have a 3D printed Inconel core with 17-4 stainless steel front and rear modules that's welded together. It also has our Hoplon baffle, our patented Hoplon baffle in there, which deflects debris. So it's going to expand the lifespan of your suppressor. And it's also covered by our lifetime warranty, which is awesome. And it's just really going to handle anything you throw at it. It's kind of a beast. So we're excited about it. Cool. What's the weight of the can with the mounting interface attached? Do you know? I think it's about 15 ounces. I believe that's without the mount. Okay. Though. So I'm not sure with the mount on there, but it's 15 ounces without, and it's about a little over six inches long. So not too long, and for you know a heavy duty can, not that not that heavy as well. This is a, a fully welded can, so does it need any real servicing from the end user? Nope, you're not going to need to really clean your can because it's fully welded. You're not going to have the same carbon buildup as well because it's not a rimfire suppressor. Um, so it's. And with our lifetime warranty, if something ever does happen, you can send it in, but you shouldn't need to, to have it cleaned or anything like that. Yeah. And compatible with all your usual ASR mounts and everything, I mean, that's that's kind of your guys' wheelhouse. Yeah, it's our Charlie mounting accessories, so you can use it with our ASR mount direct thread. It also comes with the internal Charlie flash hider front cap, which is new for us as well. So it hides the flash hider inside, but you're still going to minimize flash, but keep that nice front end cap look on there as well. The, uh, is the bore large enough to shoot uh, some of the other calibers like 6mm arc? You're going to want to stick with 5.56 on this one. Okay. Yeah, we may end up doing a 30 cal one down the line, but we're starting with 5.56, um, just keeping it super durable, um, really focusing on just you know short barreled rifles and full auto applications and things like that. So this is the first first of your cans to be with the 3D printed Inconel and with the flow through technology and Correct. that's going to expand into other stuff down the line. I mean, that's the idea probably, but we're going to start here and yeah, it's our first low blowback suppressor and we just wanted to show that, you know, you can have that effect where you don't have gas in the face without sacrificing sound suppression as well. So we've got a nice, um, nice representation of all of the benefits here of the suppressor. Awesome. Yeah. Do you know the MSRP and uh, when these are going to be available to purchase? Yes, MSRP is 1174, so street price is going to be a little less than that, and they should be available end of January, beginning of February. You should start seeing them in dealers. So, yeah, it's not super long. Um, again, great on short barrel rifles, and just benefits of suppressors in general. You know, when you're out shooting on the range, or even if this is going on a home defense gun, you don't want to blow out your ears, but you also want to enjoy your time at the range, especially if you're using a very gassy gun, a gassy platform, um, then this low blowback is going to give you the ability to just enjoy your experience with your gun and, and not sacrifice your hearing at the same time. So. What's your guys' current uh, flagship 5.56 suppressor? The Saker. Saker 5.56. The Saker 5.56, yep. So this is going to be more durable than the Saker, and it's going to offer you the low blowback. Our Saker is still a great option. Um, it's just a, it's also a durable suppressor, but this one gives you the added benefit of the low blowback feature. So. This is uh, similar overall dimensions to the Saker as well, weight, overall length? I'd have to check on the Saker weight and length. Um, I know our, our Saker a offers wider. a K version. This is wider okay. for sure, um, but our Saker does offer a K, which is going to be a little bit shorter, and we don't have that available in this LBP yet. So. It's kind of the intermediate size yeah. suppressor. Yep. Awesome. Thank you for walking us through the can, and uh, thanks everybody for watching. Stay tuned. Lots more stuff coming from Range Day and the SHOT Show floor later this week on TFB TV and TFB Showtime. And wind! So much wind! Ah. <laughs>